You know, Fox 13 has a rich heritage of outdoor segments from Salty Saul Fleischman's fishing reports. If you're old enough to remember those, Larry Ellison's down home Florida to even Chip Carter's fish and chip. Well, tonight, a new chapter. We call it making waves and we start by stalking Florida's most prized recreational fish, making waves with a captain who knows how to find them and hook them. No one has ever wondered why tarpon are called the Silver King. Their reflective beauty and their staggering size. Hence of their staggering acrobatic strength. Hook up and you better hold on and enjoy the show. There's kind of nothing like hooking into a tarpon. Hold on, got a fish. Captain Chris Wiggins, a St. Pete native. Tarpon's a pretty big deal. Specializes in these prehistoric beasts. It starts with the bait. Just make sure it's the right bait. And the greenback has a much greener back. If you see his back, it's a lot more green than this scaled sardine. In the shadows of the Sunshine Skyway Bridge, the hunt begins. Jordan, our first mate, chums with cut pieces. And these things are like many cheeseburgers to tarpon. Everybody likes free cheeseburgers. So basically, you hook one of these baits on here, on your hook, and you drop it in the water right where the chum's at. Gently feed line out with the current. And how you tell when you get a bite is your line will start shooting out of your fingers. And when they hit. It's kind of like attaching your uh, line to the back of a Corvette and telling the person to floor it. Woo! Yeah, baby. Then it's showtime. And aside from their incredible size and their strength, the fight is exhilarating. But the other part of the hunt, which is the fun part, is you can't get them year round. They're only here for a few months of the year and summertime is their peak. They love Tampa Bay's warm waters and school up on our beaches. Look carefully and a patch of what you may think is seagrass might just be a moving spool of hungry tarpon. <laughs> awesome. But they also like our residential canals. Nice and easy with him here on Light Leader. And apparently they like Captain Chris. They're not nice camera shy. Leader. And this juvenile tarpon has really good aim. <laughs> Look at that bigger tarpon eat a bait right there. Did you see me catch him in the net? So they may not always make it so easy for you. I hope you got that for TV because that was pretty awesome. <laughs> but they will always put on a show and hook you into coming back for more. You just can't beat it for the thrill of a lifetime. Dial up Captain Chris Wiggins. Here is his number. He's in Pinellas, 479-5455. You can find him on Facebook as well. Uh, the catch, though, is, no pun intended, it's yeah. all catch and release. Yes. You can't take them home oh, and yeah. you can't eat them, uh, but you get some incredible memories and pictures. That is fantastic. I know you were loving that. It was a great time. It was That's a great time, and this is the best time. The next month or so, uh, we're talking big ones too. He's seen 200 pounders there. So, so many here. fishermen out in our viewing area. So it, we're excited about his uh, new yeah. reports. We're going to see. And it won't all be fishing when we, we can. We will for sure. But some environmental pieces, all kinds yes. of stuff out on the water because we know it is truly a gem. We're going to uh, oh. we're going to highlight best we can. That's awesome. We're excited about it.